Hello and welcome back to Here We Tow. Today what we thought we'd bring is as people are starting to wake up the caravans, get it out of storage and start using them again for the holiday season, we're going to talk about something which is close to our heart and it's a serious issue. So what we're talking about today is security. We've linked up with Maypole, they've sent us out two products to have a look at so we can bring it to you. So we've got the Atlas caravan wheel clamp and we've also got the steering wheel lock. So two products we're going to have a look at, we're going to fit them on, show you how they're fitted and also explain a little bit about them as we do so. So stick with us, stay tuned and if you're interested in the steering wheel lock cover then watch us after this. About to leave, already packing, come with me. I'm not really asking, we'll get away to a place where we don't know. About to see the world in action. So why, you may be asking, are we looking at security products? Obviously with our background coming from the police, we've seen some horrendous things and the last thing that we want to see is for people to lose their possessions. We've looked at this from Maypole, the steering wheel lock cover. Ideal for your tow car or your motorhome. So what it will bring you is a little bit of additional security against keyless car theft. With keyless entry nowadays, people can steal those codes and get into your vehicle. With this, it gives a visual deterrent and also a physical barrier also, if somebody, heaven forbid, should do that. And that's why we want to bring it to you. These are things that we've been looking at that might just help you along in the security way. The unit itself weighs 2.75 kilos and it's for right hand drive vehicles only. So unfortunately, if you've got a left hand drive motorhome or a left hand drive car, then you'll have to look at another product. It ranges from 40 to 50 pounds in price, which I think is a reasonable price point for something that's gonna give you that little bit of peace of mind. The product for it itself, if you're interested, the code is MP5494 and obviously it's the Maypole steering wheel lock. It is available on all sorts of mediums. Toshaw do them. It's also available on eBay, Amazon, and other stores like that. Let's have a look at what you get in the box. And there, in its entirety, is the unit. So you've got a set of keys, you've got the lock itself, and how it works quite simply is you remove the locking bolt from the system. That then lets you extend the bar, you place it over your steering wheel, push it back in, and it'll lock the steering wheel in place, giving this physical barrier. So let's see how it fits on the car. So as you can see, this is what I mean by keyless entry. So as I explained before, I'm gonna quickly show you how easy it is to fit it. It takes seconds to fit, but that peace of mind is all what it's about. Literally, put the key in. Inside here, what you're doing is you're removing that locking mechanism, which then in turn lets you take out this bar and place it over your steering wheel. So it's as simple as this. So that's your device fitted. Simple as that. Seconds to fit, seconds to take off. So how does this steering wheel lock cover work, I hear you ask? Well, most vehicles nowadays have software that recognise low frequency ra radio ID. Your key fob is equipped with a specific electronic ID tag and the signal is amplified by a battery in there in the fob to speak with the car to let it know 
that the key is physically in the car. That's how it works with the start stop ignition button. The ways in which the vehicle are stolen are one of three ways really. The first one is by the thief copying the electronic ID and using this to actually physically fool the vehicle to think that the key is in the car, thus allowing the start and stop to work. So they'll copy the code, use that, come into the car and then set off and use the vehicle. So it thinks the, the, the key is present in that vehicle at the time and that's one of the ways. The second way is by stealing the actual physical key from your property in a burglary. This we, we used to know as a Hanoi type burglary. Because the information is so complex in the key itself, people have actually resorted now to breaking into a, a property, stealing the key, physically using the key for the car to be able to drive away with it. So that's known as a Hanoi, or some forces call it a two-in-one, because they're getting two things from one job. So basically, that's two of the ways. The third way is by a physical carjacking. What this is, is where the vehicle is stolen whilst it's being used. So it may well be that force is threatened whilst you're at a set of traffic lights, hence why cars now self-lock to lock yourself in it to keep you safe from somebody just opening the door. So that's the third way. This device will help prevent points one and point two. Point two, the Hanoi type burglary, as long as the key isn't with the physical car key, so they can just literally open the lock. So that is how this will help secure your vehicle against keyless car entry nowadays, the theft of such a thing. To explain why this product is so good and how it will protect your vehicle, the wheel lock covers the airbag, which in turn stops access to the screws and the fittings which is inside. So this stops it from being removed so that they can actually physically break this off and get to the steering wheel itself. The construction of this device is made of a strong and robust steel. And as you can see, it's nicely edged just to give it a good finish because it is going to be on and off the steering wheel quite a lot in use. It also includes an integral anti-drilling locking mechanism. So if you try and attack the lock, then that will just, it'll just spin in the device itself and you won't be able to drill through to drill that lock out. And the third thing is it's got an anti-saw bar. So this here, is made of a strong material which you can't just saw off and this to be fair is the main protecting part of the device itself let me show you if you haven't seen what how a steering lock works this is how it works if I just start the car up so we have the lock now as you can see there it fouls on the windscreen so you're not going to go any further than that it also fouls on the dashboard, so you can't get any further than that. So your range of movement is there to there. So unless you're driving in a straight line, then you're going to struggle to be able to drive away with your vehicle. So that is exactly how it works. I just thought I'd explain that just in case you've never seen why this will work. And simply to take it off, is the exact reverse so in you go with your key that'll open that off it comes that then allows you to push that back in and it's a nice secure little thing and then you're ready to head off so in summary a worthwhile product goes on in seconds easily fits, gives that visual deterrent, fantastic product. I'd like to say that it ranges from between 40 to 50 pounds. For me, that price point is pretty good. If that stops the worst from happening, then it's a worthy investment in my eyes. So I just wanted to bring that to you, an overview of exactly what it does, how to fit it, and what you can get security-wise for a car or motorhome. This has been kindly provided by Maypole which 
we've got an agreement with them that this is going to be entered into a raffle prize at Torafest, which is happening at Longleat Caravan and Motorhome Club. And all the proceeds of that raffle will be going to the Macmillan Nurses, which is a worthwhile charity in our eyes. So hopefully that some lucky person will be able to win this. So I just want to say from us, a massive thank you to Maypole for donating it, for letting us do a review on it and covering it. And also, if you like this video, then please hit the like button, subscribe if you haven't already. And what I would really like to say is we will catch you in the next one. Thanks for watching.